Hi friends, this is Carmen with you today and I'm, today I'm sharing with you two orders of succulents that I recently received. The first one is from an online store called Leaf and Clay. I've left the link at the bottom of the description and I've, this is about the fourth order I've received from them. Um, the first item is this Echeveria Black Prince. Such a beautiful Echeveria, brilliant color very healthy root system and very healthy leaves. The second item is this um, Kalinkoe tomentosa uh, panda plant. And I ordered the item that was in a four inch pot, so that's why I got three um, separate plants. They were all growing in a four inch pot, but again, the root system was very good. Love the fuzziness of these uh, tomentosa plants. And uh, this panda plant is wonderful. The chocolate soldier also um, is the Kalinkoe tomentosa and very wonderful color. Um, there's two plants there and then a little sprig here, but it's a wonderful chocolate color. The last one from them is this split rock called Royal Flush. You can see why it gets its name. It has this brilliant lavender, almost purple color to it. And this is to add to my small collection of lithops and split rocks. So I've been looking for this one for a while, but it's a wonderful uh, color and in great condition. Um, these are all from Leaf and Clay. The second order is from Pence Plants out of California. I found AJ Pence through a Facebook group called um, Succulent Marketplace USA. Again, I'll leave the link below. But I ordered four items from him. Again, all items I've been looking for. And look at this beautiful string of hearts plant. I just couldn't find it here in the Phoenix area, but I did find it in this Facebook group. It was growing in a six inch pot. That's why there's such great maturity to it. A um, little untangling to do there, but that's not a problem. And this is the popular string of pearls. I have a love-hate relationship with the string of pearls plant because I love how they look, but um, they just was dying on me all the time. So that's why I ordered a much more mature version of it to see if that will help in my not killing it. Um, the other item I ordered is this beautiful Hoya Hindu rope. I just love the braided look to the stalk with its curly leaves and it does flower these Hoyas do flower a um, grouping of little pink flowers so looking forward to getting that and it growing more stalks um, the other item I ordered from AJ was this Hawarthia zebra plant it was in a four inch pot so it's a really good size it's got wonderful striping to it so you can really see it's a zebra plant great colors to it the root system is in wonderful shape um, i also have a haworthia zebra plant in the variegated version but i was looking at um, th um, this version of it too and i'm really happy that i found it again this is from pence plants from the facebook group marketplace um, Succulent Marketplace USA and I'll leave the link down below uh, for that. I also wanted to share with you these little uh, planting tools that I got for myself. They're succulent planting tools or you can use them also for fairy gardens. They're nice little tools, little shovels, little um, water bottles and things. It's a seven piece set that I got from Amazon and it's really helped me with little areas delicate plants um, that I was needing to um, really just find something small to work with. So this has really helped me out. Wanted to show you here how I was planting them. I did use some styrofoam peanuts down at the bottom to help um, take up some space and help with the draining in both pots. But also you can take a look here at how they turned out.